more details emerge and CM Punk, is he on the brink of getting fired? Well, I tell you what, it may be. And Mandy Rose recreates Shawn Michaels' Playgirl photo from 1996. We have to take a look into that. Um, but as you can see, as previously noted, there was a physical altercation between the Elite and CM Punk and Ace Steel. Ace Steel biting Kenny Omega, battering the Young Bucks. I mean, only the Young Bucks and Kenny Omega would lose three on one to CM Punk. I mean, it's mad. It says here, they pounded at the door and then allegedly kicked down the door. So, in my opinion, three on one, is CM Punk not entitled to defend himself? Like, why is he getting sacked here? Because he won the fight? Because he fucking battered all three of them with Ace Steel? Um, so, yeah, Ace Steel... And is it, fuck, Ace Steel's wife was in the room? Fuck, what's going on here? Fucking hell, it's kicking off even up. He's even more kicking off. Um, from what we heard, Omega didn't seem nearly as upset as initially. Things got out of hand, he ended up being bitten. We're told the fight was a very long altercation. I mean, how's a very long, a very long altercation says to me this was like half an hour, but I doubt they fought for half an hour. It must have been like a, a brawl that lasted about a minute and then they were like slabbering to each other for half an hour. Um, there are rumours that Punk injured his triceps, but the belief is that happened during the match with Mox, so there's still no official word regarding CM Punk's status with AEW. So let's move on to the next bit of news, and that is several people within AEW reportedly think that CM Punk should be fired, and I mean, it could not be looking good for the guy. Uh, almost unanimously, the talent we've spoken to have been in favour, haven't been in favour of the way CM Punk handled things, because they're... Because they know, because fucking the young bucks, the EVPs, and they're all vice presidents and principals, whatever you call them, and, and of course they're going to be up there, are, so that makes total sense in my opinion, they're never going to back sides, um, you know, but in my opinion, I mean, if the EVPs have come into a room fucking slabbering, about to batter punk, with Ace Steel and his wife, sir. I mean, fuck, are they not entitled to defend themselves? I think it's embarrassing that there's legal action getting involved. I mean, if this was back in the day, they would have just let rip and batter each other. You know, but... So CM Punk could be out the door, and Punk should be fired for his actions. Personally, I think he should be given the belt, which he's already got. I mean, how much of a mess would it be, right, if he has to vacate the belt and Moxley becomes the interim champion of the game? It's like, what has been happening in AEW the past couple of weeks? Like, honestly, it's a shit show. And then the final bit of news regarding this. Um, and what is it? It's previously known that there was a physical arc. Yes, right, we get it, man. They stormed in the CM Punk's locker room. Um, but now Moxley and Jericho are going to be there for the show. So I remember that little bit. Pat Buck and Ace Steel will not be at Dynamite. Um, it's unconfirmed if they are officially suspended. And he believes other people will not be brought to Buffalo. So there you go. Dave Meltzer being the side dweeb bastard that he is. Only matches that have been announced for Dynamite. MJF is being also advertised for an appearance. Uh, what else is going on? Not, not really. So it looks like CM Punk. He could be getting fired. I, I don't know. I'm not much convinced. But let's take a look. At Mandy Rhodes recreating the Shawn Michaels play girl photo from 1996. Is it the one where he's got the belt? Or she's, oh, she's got two belts, actually. Well, there you have it. There is, there is Mandy Rhodes recreating the Shawn Michaels one. Um, I mean, the Mandy Rhodes one's better, but the Shawn Michaels one's more iconic. I'm just a sexy Kurt. Sexy. But yeah, yeah, that is... Uh, that's no bad, that. That's at the door. But anyway, guys, until next time, leave your thoughts down below and peace, motherfucker.